is six years old in July. And Julian is ten years old. Francis is a little uh, impatient, so me and my son Julian recently went on a camping trip. because he's just too impatient, like I said. So me and Julian, just me and my 10-year-old son, are out in the woods for three days. On the first day, me and Julian went looking for trees. We went looking for the tallest tree in the forest, and we found it, and we climbed it. We went fishing. We went fishing all day, but all the fish were too puny to eat, so we threw them back in the river. On the third day, we were a little bit more tired than the rest of the three day, uh, two days because we had been doing so much stuff. So we turned in early, and as me and Julie and my 10-year-old son were laying in our little sleeping bags, Underneath the stars, my son rolls over to me and he asks me, he says, Papa, what does it mean to look up to the stars at night? And I said, well, Julian, that's an awful deep question to be asking for such a small little boy. I don't mean to be insulting. I mean, you're very smart for your age, but I didn't expect that question. And he says, well, what does it mean? And I say, well... I mean, the best I can tell you is that Earth is just a little ball suspended in the midst of a big old black universe. Nobody knows what's out there, and nobody will ever know what's out there. I'm sorry I couldn't give you a better explanation. <laughs> and he says, no, Papa, that's not what it means. It means that someone stole our fucking tent. I get that. 
that shit for free. <laughs> Maybe he spent it all on faraway des plane tickets to fly him and his family to faraway destinations. <laughs> Unfortunately, I didn't think of that in time. <laughs> no. I am one man, people, and I spent $265 million in one week on a bunch of...